Well, a trio, including an ex-girlfriend, face murder charges tonight after deputies say they plotted to kill a Southern University student found shot to death. Fox 44, Sydney Simone joining us live in studio in Sydney. You have reaction from Southern and former band members. That's right, Christina and friends are saying they're even in shock over Stephen Harris's death. His body was found in Mississippi after law enforcement agencies in two states had been searching for him. The Jaguar community is mourning the loss of one of their own, Stephen Harris. He was reported missing from West Feliciana Parish on July 17th. Days later, his body was found in Wilkinson County, Mississippi. It's very distraught to hear about this situation. Um, hopefully they find out what happened to this young man. Um, he come from a great family. Harris was a sophomore studying criminal justice and a member of the Human Jukebox Band. Anthony Kinney, a former band member, says Harris was loved by many. Amazing young man, uh, very intuitive, uh, great musician, uh, great friend and leading colleague amongst his friends. Three people are in jail on charges of conspiracy to commit first degree murder. The Wilkinson County Sheriff's Office released a statement saying, quote, this is a horrific tragedy and my thoughts and prayers go immediately to the Harris family after such a tragic loss. Authorities say 21 year old Derek Terrell Hollins Jr. and 20 year old Kalia Jack, both of St. Francisville, along with 21 year old Alia Martin of Zachary, lured Harris from West Feliciana Parish to Mississippi, where he was shot and killed. All three are being held at the West Feliciana Parish Jail, awaiting extradition to Mississippi. Band director Dr. Kedrick Taylor also shared words. He says, I have known Steven since middle school, and since I have known him, he has always loved music and has been very dedicated. Steven greeted everyone with a bright smile, a firm handshake, and a unique dress style. His passion for music, particularly his love for playing the horn, and his dedication to the human jukebox was evident to all who knew him. Hopefully they find justice or find out more information what happened to him, but overall, yeah, Steven was an amazing young man. We reached out to the family but have not heard from them. This is an ongoing investigation and suspects could face additional charges. Live here in Studio Sydney Simone, Fox 44 News. All right, such a sad story. Thank you, Sydney.